We're going to explore quality function deployment, also known as house of quality. It was developed in the late 1960s as a method to design customer needs and requirements into new products prior to manufacture and delivery. It has since expanded into the development and delivery of services as well. As depicted in the image, it consists of four phases or houses, starting with customer requirements and design characteristics, and managing through design of the product or service, design of the process, and design of the controls. If you'll notice the image, we'll start with the customer requirements. From those, we'll establish design characteristics, which we'll carry into house two. Using those, we'll establish product or service characteristics, which we'll carry into house three. Then we'll define process characteristics carried forward into house four, where we'll, we'll finally define control characteristics. Now, house of quality consists of six sections. The first being customer requirements and priority ranking. Then you'll have current design benchmark and competitor analysis against customer requirements. Then we'll define design characteristics intended to deliver customer requirements. We'll determine a strength of relationship between customer requirements and design characteristics. We'll do a paired correlation between each design characteristics. Then design characteristic scores are determined and current design benchmark and competitor analysis against design characteristics is conducted. So if we look at a, an example of QFD1 or House of Quality 1, following it through with our process, we'll log the customer requirements for the product or service based on voice of customer data from market research, Kano model analysis, SIPOC interviews, or voice of customer methods. We'll enter a customer provided priority score, one being weak and five being the highest. We'll enter a score of one to five when we do an analysis of competitive products or our products against customer requirements. We'll enter a correlation score for the design characteristics relative to the customer requirements. Again, one being weak and nine being strong. We'll enter a paired correlation for each design characteristic plus for a strong correlation, a minus for a weak correlation. We'll give design priority scores to our existing product and our competitor analysis against the design characteristics. That's an example of House of Quality 1 using the process to complete the House of Quality. So please don't forget to download your complimentary Excel toolboxes containing this template and many others, and you can find that at valuegenerationpartners.com. Select the Downloads page, and each of these toolboxes representing various initiatives are available, containing many, many tools and templates. So wishing you much success as you investigate the options of using QFD or House of Quality.